Chatbots are right after virtual reality, the hottest trending big platform topic in technology as we enter 2016. Largely thanks to some major announcements recently that Microsoft and Facebook want to power them as big platforms for other partners to come in and use. So today we're launching Messenger Platform. In essence, a chatbot is any machine or server, probably in the cloud, that you have a conversation with in natural language. It figures out what you mean using artificial intelligence, and it can deliver answers that are consistent, useful, and tailored to you. And the more you use it, the more personalized it'll get. Google just announced Assistant, a chatbot technology which they emphasize will be very good at tracking your follow-on questions to get a more tailored result as you keep talking to it. We want to bring the kids this time. And then if that's the case, Google should refine the answer and suggest family-friendly options. And maybe even ask me, would you like four tickets to any of these? It will also be present in their coming competitor to Amazon Echo. This is a far cry from the dumb wooden interactions we have today with IVR systems or the pretty simple speech recognition that you have on your phone. A chatbot can be interacted with by you either through text, messaging, if you will, with characters, or can be done via voice. Either one is in the chatbot realm. Much of the interest in chatbots comes from this concept that we may have hit peak app or app saturation, that there is only so much you can do when you ask people to download an app and deal with an actual visual interface that is limited by the features that were written into it by the software developer. Most of us want to have an intuitive conversation rather than interface navigation. Now, if done poorly, a system this powerful and this variable can go left kind of hard. Microsoft learned that in an early demonstration of their chatbot technology. If done right, however, brands, retailers, information sources will find that they can have thousands, even millions of conversations at once with all manner of consumers and present a consistent portrayal of themselves without all the vagaries that we now have in sort of the tired triad of join us in the social conversation, download our app to go with your 900 others, or call or see one of our reps who are very likely unevenly trained. In many ways, the chatbot is about creating one essence of a brand or entity, not millions of fragments of it.